So I have this black Aria acoustic to repair. It's got a lifting bridge, which as you can see is it's really quite bad. Um, so I'm going to have to take the bridge off and re-glue it. Um, first thing I'm going to do is to take the strings off. And uh, when this came to me, it was actually still up to pitch. And I'm not sure how the bridge was still holding on. Um, but if you notice this thing happening to your bridge, I suggest before you do anything, take the tension off the strings so it doesn't rip the bridge off the wood and uh, tear out the wood and then make it a harder repair to do. So hopefully I'll be able to heat this up and, and carefully take it off and re-glue it. Now I can see where it's lifting up that the finish has not been scraped back properly. So I'm going to carefully score around the bridge so that I can scrape away the finish after I remove it. So I've got a piece of cardboard here to protect the top of the guitar and a piece of greaseproof paper to protect the iron. I'm going to slowly heat up the bridge which should uh, melt the glue and help me lift it off with a spatula. As you can see, the bridge came off very cleanly. I'm very happy about that. But you can also see that there is a big lip of finish all the way around where the bridge should be glued on. And what that does is it raises it off the wood and the glue doesn't really fill that gap, which is why it probably came off in the first place. Um, so I'm going to have to scrape away that finish and sort of inset the bridge into the guitar. I'm just going to take it very carefully and very slowly. I'm just using my bandsaw table to clean up the back of the bridge and make sure it's nice and flat. Both the bridge and the body are now nice and clean and flat and ready to get glued together. I'm just going to wipe the back of the rosewood with some acetone to clean off any oils and then I'm going to use my homemade clamping cool to uh, clamp them together. And I'm just going to glue it with some tight bond original. Just being really careful to make sure that I've got this in the right place because I don't want any of that 
that wood's showing. So I'm just trying to clean up the glue as it go, just to make sure. I think that's looking like it's in the right place, so. So as you can see, I can't even get a piece of paper under there now, so it's a nice tight joint all the way around. And uh, hopefully that will hold up this time. I've got the guitar tuned up now and the bridge is holding great. Uh, the saddle I made a slight adjustment to and now the guitar is playing really nicely. Uh, it's got a nice low action about the 2.5 to 2 mil at the 12th fret on the E strings. Um, and uh, it sounds pretty good so I'm very happy and hopefully the customer will be happy too. Mm -hmm.